Charles IV, King of Bohemia and Holy Roman Emperor, had a long and successful. Thank you so much for joining me as Game Edge. Unfortunately, the Empire game is having a little bit of issues. Argue. As you guys can hear, I'm having just a little bit of issues launching for some reason. It was a new update that just occurred on it, I think. And I'm just trying to get this sorted. There we go. On oh, sorry, on the OBS. <laughs> for some reason, it is not playing fine. It's not playing right. We're just going to listen to the story and get to know it. I didn't get really to kind of play with it. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to actually switch over to the screen here. And hopefully this time it will work properly. And we can actually hear the story as we go. It just, it's one of those, you know, startup things. It's all good. Hopefully this will work and we're good to go. Hope you guys are all doing good. We'll just talk right afterwards. How you all doing? Nice to see you, Jeffers. This is actually a really cool game if you haven't seen it before. Um, it is very cool. Hopefully I can actually see it too. King of Bohemia and Holy Roman Emperor had a long and successful reign. The empire he ruled from Prague expanded and his subjects lived in peace and prosperity. When the emperor died, the whole empire mourned. More than 7,000 people accompanied him on his last procession. The heir to the throne of the flourishing empire was Charles' son, Wenceslas IV, whose father had prepared him for this moment all his life. But Wenceslas did not take after his father. He neglected affairs of state for more frivolous pursuits. He even failed to turn up for his own coronation as emperor which did little to endear him to the Pope. Wenceslas the Eye did not impress the Imperial nobility either. His difficulties melted until the nobles, exasperated by the inaction of their ruler, turned for help to his half-brother, King Sigismund of Hungary. Sigismund decided on a radical solution. He kidnapped the king to force him to abdicate, then took advantage of the ensuing disorder to gain greater power for himself. He invaded Bohemia with a massive army and began pillaging the territories of the king's armies. It is here that my story begins. Very cool story so far to start off with. Man, I'm, I'm stoked for this. I'm stoked. It looks really cool. We're actually going to do a new game right away. Like I mentioned, I don't have very much knowledge base on this one. I did, well, a lot of friends of mine who are doing um, streams and stuff were telling me I'm better off having a controller on this one. For some reason, it seems like it's a little bit tough to actually get into a fight. So how y'all doing there? Thank you for being here. Do appreciate it. Toon, how y'all doing, Sky? Thank you, Casey. And of course, all the mods, thank you for being here. Do appreciate it. Bay, be witch, how you doing, Sky? Mystic. Gaming Central, Jesse. How y'all doing? Thanks for being here, guys. Very, very cool. Yeah, this game is just off the hook. Now, it is very expensive. I'll be honest with you. It is very expensive, and I did not pay for it. I did get a copy from the developers. I always mentioned that when, when you get it. But I do get a lot of copies, and this one is really amazing. I have to say, it may be worth it. Let's see what it looks like. So far, the graphics are stunning. I do like stories. In games like this. Wow. Wow, shit. Massive kingdom. Hey, Matthew, nice to see you. Good to see you, bro. Lady, dangerous. How are you before? How are you doing? Piaz, Aaron, how are you all doing? Game in Central. Kingdom Come Deliverance. Holy moly, man, they did some work on this game. I can see why it's a little bit expensive. That is a lot, a lot of work. And big. If it looks anything like this when we're on the ground, I'm sold. <laughs> oh my god, look at the mines. I've never seen such splendor. Wow. 
I, I'm, I'm shocked. This is shock and awe right here. <laughs> hey, Luz. Nice to see you on your side. Villar. Today's a scorcher. Hard work, man. Hard work. Oh, wow. Well, husband, how goes it? Good. I should get it finished today. Well, needed to watch some errands. He was still sleeping when I went out. At this hour, blue blooded idler. Well, it looks like he was out all evening, drinking like a lord. <laughs> Go and get the lazy bones up then. Quick clout round the ear should do it. Mm -hmm. I love how he's strutting his stuff there. <laughs> Get up now. There's work to be done. Hello. Mm. Comfortable bed there. Hello. Hear that? You'd better not vex him. Now get up quick. Your breakfast is on the table. Wait, what's this? <laughs> have you been. Oh, Henry. How many times have I told you about fighting? Oh, it's nothing. It's just a scratch. You've been at that sword play again, haven't you? You better pray your father doesn't get to hear of it. You know how he feels about it. Oh, don't worry, it wasn't that. I, I just scratched myself is all. Hmm. Well, just don't come crying to me if you really do get hurt. Now get up, you rogue. <laughs> this is awesome. Oh. Music's nice, everything's beautiful in this game. Please tell me it's as nice when we start playing. Please tell me it's as nice. Quest started. Unexpected visit. A fine state you're in this morning. Oh, wow. What on earth did you get up to last night? Hey, Empire, how are you doing? Oh, uh, hmm. In that tavern, I was dancing. I could get guilty for that at vitality and strength. Hmm. Here we go. I'm going to go for strength. I was sweating in the forge all day yesterday, and then I was helping Fritz and Matthew with some errands. So I'd say I have a right to be a bit tired. Well, I've got a feeling there's something you're not telling me. And it's connected with that scratch on your hand, and that suspicious-looking character with a sword who turned up in town recently. Hmm. All right, we get speech up, agility, vitality, and strength. And go for some vitality. I was with Bianca. Do you want a blow-by-blow -blow account of everything we did? <laughs> What's this, an interrogation? All right, all right. Sorry, son. It's just that I worry about you. Thanks, Ma, but I'm not four years old. I know, Hal. You've grown up in front of my eyes. It's hard to get used to it. <laughs> cool. All right, um... There you go. Father angry with me for sleeping late. He's not happy. Yesterday you promised him you'd help finish that sword for Saratzik. He's not as young as he was. And you know how his joints pain him. He's too proud to complain. But he needs your help, Henry. I know. Don't worry, Ma. Of course I'll help him. Good. Great he always says his knees ache when there's a storm coming. I hope they're wrong this time. It's looking like such a nice day. Wow, oh, okay. Let's see here. Um, my friends come by. I'm hungry. Ah, better make sure she needs to do up. anything, man. Ah, you're a good lad. But I'm fine. It's your father needs helping with that sword. Oh, lockpicking's hard, eh? I can't wait to see that. Did Matthew and Fritz come looking for me? No, I haven't seen them this morning. They shouldn't be hard to find. They'll be hanging around a tavern somewhere, as usual. <laughs> All right. Uh, I'm gonna go with this one. Not this again. 
Don't be disrespectful. Lie, mother. Don't be disrespectful to your parents. All right, um, I'm hungry. Can I get something to eat? <laughs> Please. <laughs> I left some breakfast on the table. Help yourself. All right, cool. I guess that's it. End of dialogue. We found out everything we need to know. Excellent. Let's see here. Yeah, the controller is a lot easier. I'll take that. I'll take that. I'll take that. <laughs> I don't know if I should take all the food from my mother, but I mean, she's she's cooking still, so I'm pretty sure it's okay. <laughs> we'll, we'll take what we can. I think that's meant to like that for the game. I wouldn't do that in my real family, of course. It'd be uh, less greedy. But uh, I do think we're going to need the, the food and uh, for us to get up here. So thank you. How y'all doing here? Do you think uh, you're going to do more Sunday's Guy? Yeah, of course. What? Sunday's Die Gameplay. I always do more. Every day. There's more coming out today. Always, always. Jeez, uh, man. Just take everything from your mom. Oh, well. It is a game. It's all good. Yeah, right off the stove. That's got to be burning hot. Beautiful, beautiful game. Yeah, it's more cinematic when you actually use a controller. People have mentioned that. It's actually a whole lot better. Um, it's harder with the mouse. I did play for about two minutes. I skipped over the actual conversations we had here. Because I didn't want to go through them all. Wow, we can come back for a lot of food here. They're not running out. They're doing good. You can actually pick up all this stuff, I guess. Or can we? Well, I can't pick up these apples. Well, she has more. She has more. So that's good. We're not leaving them alone. They even have some roots and stuff. All right, we're good. Where's Pa? Where's Ma and Pa? Gets nice and strong by hitting. <laughs> Can't see it too funny. All right, so Ma's out here. We can actually eat off the cookery there. Let's see what the controllers are. How are you running us? I don't know which one you run with. Hard to tell. Hopefully they'll walk us through it. Hey, Pa. At least you're up. That's a start. Anyway, we have a lot of work to do today. I'm finishing the sword for Sir Radzik, and I need your help. With what? I'm running out of charcoal. Run to the market and buy a bag from the charcoal burner. I'll need some money then. Hello, friend. Well, that's the other thing. Hello, friend. Kunesh still owes me for an axe, a hammer, and the nails I sold him a month ago. Bastard. Not to mention his debt from before. Oh, nice. Go and tell him to pay up, at least for the axe and hammer, and then use the money to buy the charcoal. Right, that's Kunesh, that drunkard. <laughs> That'll be fun. Well, you're a big lad now. I'm sure you can manage. If not, tell him that next time I'll come myself and personally use that hammer to bang those nails into his arse. Holy interesting. I'd be happy to hear it. <laughs> Is that all? Not quite. The Chamberlain at the castle has the cross guard for Sir Radzik's sword, which I had engraved in Sasal. You want me to go and pick it up? All right. Money, charcoal, cross guard. Got it. And ale. <laughs> Stop off at the tavern <laughs> on your way home. I know you'll be going there anyway to see that girl of yours. But make sure the ale's still cool from the cellar when you get back. Her name is Bianca. Right, so make sure Bianca draws me a nice cool one. Run along now. Work won't wait. Work won't wait. All right, that's good. So Dad wants us to go and kick the shit out of that guy's ass if he doesn't give up the money. That's pretty cool. Can you guys hear properly? Just in case, is it loud enough for their volume? I, d I don't know if that's uh, something I could place up and I'll check it out. Hey, no problem, Chris. Good to see you. King Central, thank you all for being here. Sky. Mmm, beans. I do like my beans. I just don't know how to run yet. Where's the, where's the run button in this thing? Does it actually tell you? Settings. Advanced settings. Controls. I'm using a controller now to see if it actually works better. If not, I can actually just hop on a keyboard. Um, uh, where is run on this? It would be kind of nice. Sit down. Mouse. Jump. Sprint is left shift and what for this doesn't tell you so controller doesn't have oh you know what it is okay that's crouch the king won't get his silver i don't know i can't seem to figure out how to run on this thing is he running now i don't know if he's running so okay we'll check it out if not i'll just hop onto the keyboard 
it's somewhat quiet, is it? All right, let's just make sure we guys can hear properly. I don't want to make sure that, uh, you know. Pater Noster, qui es in seris, sanctificeto nomen tuum, veniat regnum tuum, fiat voluntas tua, sicut in celo et in terra, panem nostrum sub. I'm not sure what he was saying, but I hope it wasn't anything bad. Um. <laughs> All right, let's go. All right, where, where is this son of a bitch? Uh, let's see, what's the map on this? I tell you, I think I'm going to have to switch over the keyboard the way it's going. All right, wow. Holy shit. That's pretty insane. Oh, there's a map, right? So it's top, right? All right, so where's our first guy here? There, Kunesh. So we're actually right beside Kunesh right now. Is he to the left here? You discovered the traitor. That's good. Yes, the traitor's next door. Hey, Kunesh, how are you doing? What the hell? I mean, what the hell? Seems like a rude son of a bitch. God be with you, Kunesh. What do you want? <laughs> Thought I sent me for money. Shit. My father sent me to get the coin you owe him for the axe, hammer, and nails. I've got nothing. Clear off. Hmm. Um, I'll start with the first one. You know you owe father for a lot more than just the axe and hammer. If he went to the bailiff about it, you'd be in deep water. At least pay for the tools if you can't pay for everything. Yeah. I told you I have no coin, you bastard. Get the hell out of here, or I'll use the axe on you. Oh, shit. All right, so we have persuasion here. Uh, it's these are all different things you can actually do in the next text dialogue. MLH's social uh, status was paramount and equality, so you can choose different ones. Uh, if you look dangerous, people be afraid to cross you. All right. Special cases, you can try Henry's other skills. Example, so horsemanship. All right. I'm going to actually go with... I know, screw you. I must have misheard you. It sounded like you just told me to clear off. But you wouldn't be stupid enough to think you can steal, not pay your debts, and then try to scare me. Would you? You son of a whore. How dare you speak to me like that? Didn't your thieving father teach you any manners? No? Well, I'll teach you then. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. I see. I hope this is going to work out well. All right. We can actually kick with left trigger. Right trigger. Okay. But again, I'm playing with the controller, testing it out, because so many people told me to do it before I did this. All right, if not, all right. So the top here is choose attack direction. So that little star, we actually have to find it, make it red where we want to hit him. You can attack from the grieving. Okay, that's good. That's very cool. Stamina, health uh, is okay. Hey, son of a bitch. Wow, hello. You like that? Want some kicks? Huh? A little kick in the nads? Huh? Want some of that? Wait, you, you want some George Foreman shit? Huh? You want oh. some George Foreman? Huh? Oh, shit! Shit, shit. I should look where Block was. Alright, alright. Kick him back, kick him back, kick him back. Show what you're made of. Come on, you little shit. Oh, wow. Nice round. Ooh. Oh shit. See a little bruise on the side of your chin? Yeah, I think it's you bleeding. Sod it! <laughs> they, they translated that? Oh shit! That's rough. Oh, you little shit! That's my freaking testicles. Wow. Now, now. Huh? Oh, what's up with that shit? Oh, Christ. Gone weak at the knees, have you? No, if you're just kicking me in the friggin' balls all the time. God damn. Huh? Your face is not gonna look the same after this is over. Oh, shit. My nads either. Oh, forget about the kids. Bianca can just keep that. Won't we'll have to get fixed for anything. There'll be no children coming from me. Oh. oh. I want to give you a little bit of air, dude. There we go. You want to start kicking? Oh, 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 shit. 
Wow, he's a super blocker, man. God. God's not gonna help you right now, brother. All right, warfare. Wow, this is a lengthy ass fight. All right, let me just get my stamina back, brother. Ow! Holy shit! You son of a. Whoa, 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 it's like some special skill. When he goes in like slow motion, but it's so tough to. Oh, 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 oh. Oh, did he just use that? Man. That's a bad thing to say, bro. No wonder you're alone. <laughs> oh my god. Holy moly. I, th I don't know, man. Maybe the keyboard and mouse would have been easier. You'll get Oh! Oh shit! Oh, <laughs> did I get him? Enough! Enough! I give up. Take what you want. It's not much, but it's all I have. You understand? No, you hit me. You hit me bad, brother. I'm freaking finishing ah! this shit. No, 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 we're not done. You better find a freaking guards as quick as you possibly can. Oh, you're gonna run? You're gonna run away? We're gonna do we're gonna get some help from the guards? I think he has shit. Oh god. <laughs> think the guards are gonna come and hurt me? Hope I don't end up in prison or something stupid like that. I don't even know how to run right now. All right, we'll take all. Press A. All right, cool. All right, I should probably get the hell out of here. Oh, yeah, I'm taking the axe too. All right, cool. I'll wash myself in there too. Hope you don't drink out of that. Son of a bitch. <laughs> Thanks, Casey. Yeah, he says some. Some nasty things. I don't know if I if I punch him now, I cause them to go and get the guards or something. Seems like I kind of got to run away for for help. Oh, there he is. I don't think I'm finished with them. I think I want your clothes too. Yeah. What do you think about that? Are you, are you coming up to me, really? Yeah, you better go and step that shit over there. Yeah, come around that corner, brother. <clears throat> nothing to see here, ladies and gentlemen. Nothing, that's nothing. This guy uh, hit me in a testicular area, and I'm not too fond of that. Sorry, sorry. Yeah. <clears throat> Why don't you go inside your house for a bit there? Oh, shit. Want to go get your mommy? Huh? Want to go get your mommy? Go get your mommy. You little crap head. He deserves every punch he got there. Let's close this door. Hey, thank you. Hey, anybody else here want to kick me in the ads? No? Okay, good. <laughs> Welcome, Henry. <laughs> oh, God. oh, you need ice? Yeah, my God, that looked like it was painful. Uh, Bane, this guy. Hey, Dread, nice to see you. Classic. Hilly, love watching your videos. Thanks, Hilly. Big th thank you. Appreciate that very much. Moment 4, thank you so much for the host. Also, um, I got here Dragon Child. Thanks for subscribing on uh, Twitch and on YouTube. Thank you so much. And uh, Spence's, uh, what's that? Spence's. Spencem699, thank you so much for the follow. Really do appreciate it, guys. All right, um, let's talk trade. Hopefully uh, the, co the the guard's not going to come and take away from me here. All right, let's see your trade itself. Cycle back and forth, sort. How do I sell? Add to basket, check basket. I don't want to check baskets, I want to sell. I right, go through here. Does it tell you how to sell things? I don't see it, guys. Am I going crazy? Got item info. Check basket. How about what's in my stuff? Got some bread and stuff. I need to get nails or something, didn't I? Coal, charcoal. I, I don't have any cash, though. Oh, I actually was able to buy. Oh, it's in a basket. All right. Um, I don't think that's what you really wanted was that mostly, right? 
All right, check basket. Let's haggle. You don't have enough money. Where is still oh, it's up top. I see it. You can't move with a mouse. Oh, it doesn't let you. I don't know. There you go. Okay, I have to learn to use a controller. I don't use controllers very often. All right, sell. Uh, we can sell his axe and his nails. How about that? Let's sell those things. Let's not sell our clothes. And let's see here. Check basket. Now. Say my I go. name. I don't have money. Eisenberg. How much money You're is this? Goddamn right. Balls of steel. Food twenty. Balls of steel. <laughs> Alright, so they want twenty for this thing, don't they? Balls of steel. Thank you, Fibro. Big hashtag. <laughs> That's a fiber thing. Support your stream like that. Alright, so I, I do have to haggle with food. Is this what we're doing here? I have to figure this out. Close deal. I'm selling this, his hammer, his nails, and this is what quality is still good. Just tell me what I'm getting for these. Remove. Yeah, this oh no, remove all of it. And we'll try to just get the coin first. All right. I haggled with her. This, I guess a load sequence of this is a little bit slower for the trade. All right, let's trade. I saw the coal before for da. Do you guys know how much coal he wanted? I think it's 10, right, Max? We'll see what we can pick up because yeah, I got to pick up AL too. So right now up, uh, you pay your wealth is 7.1. Trader's wealth is 72.9. Reputation is 94. All right. How much is one? 0.4. All right, I think we can do this now. That'll be 10. That'll give us four bucks. I think that'll be enough for, for his dad, right? Yeah, I think it'd be okay. All right, let's haggle this out. Oh, you have to hold down the X. Let's have a word about the price. Why not? Why not? All right, all right. Shit. <laughs> Angle goes both ways. You select the amount you want to pay. Confirm A with the traders. All right. Wow. Okay, that's pretty in depth. If the answer is a refusal, he or she may counter offer. All right. What do I want to pay? I want to pay the this much. Let's see if uh, let's be not let's not be too cheap. Forget it then. Oh shit! Right away. Oh, wow. Okay, I went. I went like too low. I thought we would have like a back and forth. Maybe I was too rude with her. All right, all right, all right, all right. Game age made a mistake. Right, let's do ten again. Let's be polite. I didn't haggle about my other stuff. You think you should be kind enough to do this? I guess the skills too are gonna have to happen. Let's try to. Hey, Bradonna, nice to see you. Let's Bait. talk about the price. I. All right. Let's let's not be super rude. Let's say three point three. Okay. Let's. What about this? You won't convince me with that. No. Okay. Uh, she's going three point eight. All right. Uh, how about three point four? What do you say to this? I'd almost shake on that. Oh. Almost. Three point six, I guess. Let's 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 go a little close to each other here. Tough luck. Oh yes, son of a bitch. All right, so her point is, <laughs> God, she's annoying. All this for saving a couple of coin, but they're so hard to find in these days. You have no choice but to actually haggle and have to get used to us it too. It's pretty cool. Message me. Okay. Um. Let's see here. Sorry, guys. Trading is part of the game. It's going to have to get used to it, and I'm just going to see how far I can go. So really, uh, when she says that last part, for now, until my skills go up, I'm going to have to kind of settle with that one. That's fine. That's fine. I'm all cool with that. I'm all cool. Let's check basket. i got to haggle. Can't, I'm not going to pay full price. I'd like to discuss the price. Again. Why not? Yeah, why not? We've done this three times now. 
I think the third time would be a charm. All right, let, let's go back down to 3.3, .3, where I started. Are we agreed? That's a poor offer. No, oh, I'm sorry. Wow, all right. Uh, we go one more time. How about 3.5? Tough luck. Oh, for freak's sake. Okay, I'm just going to pay 3.8 next time, okay? <laughs> she, she's sticking to her 3.8. Oh, my God. She's ball break. This woman's tough. I'll give her props. I like her. I like her attitude. Her attitude's good. Her attitude's really cool. Hey, guys, liking the game? It looks really nice. There's more to this, of course, than what I'm doing right now, of course. Bump, bump, bump. But uh, part of the game, unfortunately, is this. And if you're looking for something that's quite intuitive, it is very expensive. I'm not going to lie to you. But it looks freaking awesome, doesn't it? All right, last time we're doing 3.3, and then we're going to sell out 3.8. I'll, I'll just pay a little bit extra, whatever. I don't want to go through this anymore. Let's have a word about the price. Yeah, you haggle a little bit. Aye. Aye? All right, let's do this. <laughs> let's, let's do this again. Since it's you. <laughs> More. More? I'll, I'll just pay the 3.8. I knew we'd come to an arrangement. All right, cool. Yeah, that's cool. We, we saved some coin. I guess we can steal, too, and get ourselves in deep trouble. Yeah. Yeah, we got to be careful not to steal anything here. Pretty sure she, uh, her guard over there would kick my arse. Hope that I'll be happy. Henry, I'm glad you stopped by. Yeah. Could have been a little nicer with the price there, dear. Holy crap. She was kind of rough with me. All right, that's all good. Hey, Elizabeth. How you doing? Oh, nice to see you, Elizabeth. I hope everything's good with the kids and your family and your husband. Um, I was getting map. Let's check out where we're at. So we did this. Buy t ale at tavern and a sword. Go to sword fighting lesson. All right, sword fighting lesson. Do I need a sword? Oh, it's on top map too. I can see it. Look at the chickens. Man, the graphics are beautiful. They're stunning. Game looks solid. Open world, no problems. Very fluent, no glitchiness, nothing. I'm even streaming with this, so... Oh, shit. Well, that's that's not a way. Can I go through this little alleyway? Does it let me? You know if I'm really remarked by this beauty of this game? <laughs> this game is stunning. Can I fit in there? <laughs> game has died while trying to crawl between buildings. Oh my god, that's too funny. I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I pushed you around. Be careful with that. Where is run on this thing? Um, settings. I'm getting tired of just walking around here. Controls, and where's run? It's on the top left there. Bump, bump, jump, climb, stab, hook, melee, kick. How about run? Do we have run at all in this thing? Range weapons. Jump, climb, mount, call horse, which is why. Use, pick up. I don't, I don't see run. Why is that? Sprint. Oh, there you go. Left. Oh, left, left shift. But that doesn't. Oh, okay. Well, there we go. Red the tavern. You can't be serious, Deutsch. Insulting our king. What insult? I say only the truth. Sigismund has done only what he had to. Had to? He had to abduct the king. He had to lure his cousin Prokop into a trap and imprison him. He had to invade with his army of Tatars and besiege Kutenberg. Why not? What is this Wenceslas for a king? The empire is falling asunder in his hands. The German counts elected Ruprecht of the Palatinate as king because your Wenceslas would not go to their deeds even. German counts? Traitors. Now even the Pope God be with you, Henry. I'm with you, Matthew. What's going on here? Deutsch is spouting shit. What? Just listen and you'll hear for yourself. Someone has to bring order and reunite the Empire. <laughs> what do I care about the Austrians? And nowadays, not even the devil himself can keep up with all the Popes. Which is the rightful Pope? The one in Rome or the one in Avignon? Do not blaspheme, Alex. No, it's true, though. Wenceslas is the king of Bohemia. Bohemian nobles are on his side. To hell with Rosenberg and his cabal. 
Sir Ratzik is Wenceslas commander in chief. He stayed loyal to the king. And if he heard you talking like this, he would have you whipped like a dog. Your deal will soon have nothing left to rule. Jobs had to sell Luxembourg to help your king. South Bohemia is with Sigismund and... don't and forget about Gutenberg, where Germans like you kissed Sigismund's feet to keep their heads. Yes, but... Goodman Deutsch, this is pointless. Let us talk of more pleasant things. My words, exactly. Deutsch has gone too far. Wenceslas is our rightful king. Deutsch is an idiot. But what can you do? I might have an idea. Deutsch deserves to be taught a lesson, doesn't he, Fritz? You're too wide, Matthew. You should give him a proper Shh. hiding. <sighs> Are you mad? Do you want to end up in the pillory? Don't listen to Fritz. I've got a better idea. Deutsch was talking such shit, it made me think of that huge parlement You know, the one right next to his freshly whitewashed house. <laughs> you think we should redecorate for him? Count me in. Well, I'd rather touch it, to be honest. But, doing some turds will do. What do you say, Henry? But I was going to get ale for a father and a, a few other things. We're finishing Sir Ratzik's sword. Come on. Doing a few handfuls of manure is not going to take all day. And it's our duty to defend the honor of our king. So, how? Are you with us? Oh man, the voice acting is really good. I mean, really good. <laughs> I, I can see where the investment of money went. Uh, you can see it everywhere. The game is stunning. Absolutely stunning. A little bit load, maybe a faster computer. But yeah, it's it's massive, this game. Oh, B. Okay, I'm going to give it a shot. Lutz, thank you. I didn't see you say that. Thank you. I'll give it a shot. Um, oh, God. I'll do it. Oh, well. Father can wait a while. Oh, shit. <laughs> My words exactly. I know it's not I knew right. you wouldn't miss out on all the fun. Let's go. It's fun. <laughs> Hope this doesn't affect me. Oh, B. Thank you, Luz. You're absolutely amazing. Luz. Thank you so much. Well, that's his house here. All right. Discuss the plan of attack. Okay. So are we doing this or not? Wait. We have to check that the coast is clear. Why? The Deutsch is in the tavern. But maybe you noticed after all these years that he has a wife and a son. And that's a problem? Aye, it is. Henry, you go and lure her away somehow. Why me? <laughs> because you're the clever one. Yeah. Great. We lure her away. Hey. Hey, how you doing? Casey, thank you so much for three minutes. Thank you so much for there. What do you want, lad? The turd decorations about to be interesting. <laughs> your husband's making trouble. I just went by the tavern and your husband was in there talking nonsense. I thought someone should take him home before he gets himself in trouble. What sort of nonsense? Well, uh... Well, he kept saying that Sigismund was right and King Wenceslas is a drunkard, that sort of thing. Some people took exception, so I thought... God almighty, the fool. Next thing he'll start on about the Popes. He might have mentioned the Popes too. Thank you for telling me. I just hope I can catch him before he gets into another fight. All right. She's gone. See you later. <laughs> Great place to put your shit right beside your house, idiot. Am I supposed to pick up the poop now? Because I, I don't really pick up poop. I mean, I did the other thing. You guys do this. Oh, for God's sakes, don't be first when to grab it. Oh, for God's sakes, don't sculpt it. What are you waiting for, soldier? Fire the trebuchet! For king and country! For king and country, my ass! This is all good, clean, fun. 
Nearly as good as having that traitor in the pillory. Nearly. Now that would be sweet. <laughs> That's for Sigismund. Woohoo! Eat shit, Doshus. You bastards! What the fuck do you think you're doing? <laughs> <laughs> hey, Hans. Can't you see? We're decorating your house for you. It's like your old man was saying in a tavern about that traitor Sigismund. We're just doing what we have to do. Oh, sons! I'll make those smiles off your faces! Oh, I'd like to see you try. What are you doing here, Zbizek? Hanging out with this poxy Deutsche? Maybe you'd like to try out the latest German fashion. <laughs> Fucker! I'll make you pay for oh my that! God. <laughs> oh, well, you know. Boys be boys. <laughs> I probably would have thrown a shit to him. Oh, shit. Oh, you're so gonna get this shit, man. We're gonna beat you up. Are you, are you cowering? Are you carrying? Alright, cool. He's done. What are you doing? Yeah! Stop right now! The catch pole is on the This is my boy? No, it's my boy. Damn! Oh, whoa, whoa, why does it fling up like that? Oh, because I'm a... Oh, there's my own boy! Better fuck... Hey! I thought the same. What are you doing? We don't have to run. We're on the right. Ah, yes. Sorry. It's just that's never happened to me before. Wait, am I supposed to run away? I mean, I don't really run for shit. Where, where do they all go? I don't think I should run away. I mean, I missed that out completely. I'm ready to fight, man. I was like, who is he? He's so green. Oh, shit. That's why. That guard's after me, isn't he? Um, uh, your house looks beautiful. Is that guard after me? The catch pole. Meet the lats at Kanesh. Alright. Isn't Kanesh here? What are we having for supper, asshole? You think this shit's over with? Get up. Get up, you little shit. Come on, get up. Get up. No, no. It's not over with. Every day of your life, I'm going to make your life miss. Oh, did you fall down like that? Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. I, I can pick up your body, too. Look at this. I'm going to pick it up. And I put it inside where the pigs lie. Right over here. Yeah. <laughs> there you go. Where'd you go? Drop. Hold it. There you go. Oh my god, right through. Oh my god, he clipped right through. Alright, well, hey. Guys, close. I told you I was going to get him back. I was going to get his ass back no matter what. Thanks so much again, Casey. Thank you so much for supporting the stream, guys. I do appreciate it. Um, Alright. I just look around here, up A, and he's going to wake up and get so pissed off. I got all his clothes. Let's see here. Map. Pick up the cross guards there. I have to go next. I have to pick up AL next, right? Is it an AL? I have to pick up first and the AL last, right? Go to sword fighting lesson. I'll have to get that afterwards. Uh, buy an AL tavern. Meet the lads at Kunesh. All right. I guess I have to go. And meet the lads Good first. To you, Henry. Let's go meet the lads. <laughs> I had no choice but to take his stuff. Sorry, it's coming through. Serious? Yeah, I'm serious. Hey, by the way, I just beat the shit out of that guy. Uh oh. Uh oh. They're having a little bit of a conversation about what happened. I'm going the wrong way, am I? I saw the guys run down here. 
Where the frig is Kunesh's place? It's not exactly easy to find this place at all. I'm right over here. <laughs> it's all the way up top. Oh my god. I was there. For frig's sake. I thought the other guy who went there was not the brave one. It ends up being my character. It, it smells like poop. Yep, yep. The guard's just sitting there. <laughs> oh my god, you gotta love it. Dead, uh, Dread Pirate, thank you so much, buddy. Always appreciate it. Thanks for being here, too. Taking care. Hello, Peggy. Nice to see you. How come I didn't see this? Or is he next to him or what? I'm sorry, I'm a little slow on this one. But I gotta figure out what the where the lads are. And the map isn't too intuitive for me. As of yet, I'll have to get used to it. Oh, for God's sakes, boys. You guys are chickens. I, st I stood there. I stood there and took it. Oof. He's gone. Yeah, what? Dodge. That was close. I almost got caught thanks to that damn Deutsch. You know, you know it's a small town. They probably know who you are, right? You guys know that, right? Of course. All right. They they don't know that. Well, we sorted that Deutsch out. <laughs> that was pretty close, eh? Yes, my dad won't be happy, Mystic. That old bastard didn't stand a chance. True, but I'm worried that fucker Hans will snitch on us. Well, let him. Then I'll snitch on him. And anyway... What can they do to us for throwing a bit of dung? Good point. It's not as if anyone really likes the Deutsch. That's lucky. Yeah, it was, warned us. Nice job. There we go. Anyway, nice job at the Deutsches. Never a dull moment with you lot. <laughs> <laughs> nice grinder. <laughs> Alright, we can actually make our way back and do this. Yeah, Mystic, I don't think he's going to be too happy. Is he alive now, or did I kill him? I think he was unconscious, right? Are you, are you sleeping again? Oh, shit, wake up. Oh, fuck, wake up, wake up, wake up. Okay. Every day of his life, I'm going to walk by and beat the schnod out of him. That's for what he did. Hey, Jaden, nice to see you. Nice to see you. Okay, next step, we're going to have to head out. I wish we could put... We put the, Full screen, quit full screen. Zoom marker X. Okay, cool. We actually have to go right there. Let's put the marker. Does it help at all? Because I, I don't see it as help. Oh, okay. Didn't have to get the L. My God, my dude. He's making it freaking hard, isn't he? A little picky. Let's move my head up a bit. There we go. You got to admit, the guy deserves every ounce of that. Hey, Noah. Good to see you, buddy. I'm a little out of breath. Is this it? I'm in the wrong place. Of course I am. Oh, it's the right place. Just talk to the guards. We have to say, sir. I'll take your sword from you. I'll be with you. I'm with you, Henry. How are you? Okay. Uh, was denouncing a king in a tavern. Okay. I came for the cross guard. Hmm. Eh, ain't no snitch. Father sent me. We're forging a sword for Sir Radzik, and the Chamberlain has the cross guard and grip. Father had them engraved in Sassau. Right. They're here. The Chamberlain gave them to us for you. We looked them over. Beautiful work. I've never seen anything so fine. I can't wait to see the sword. Just make sure you don't botch it. When did I ever botch anything? <sighs> Where shall I start? Ah, shut up and give me what I want or I'll kick your ass this evening. Right away, your lordship. Just cut those in your back pocket, do Magnificent. You? Shame I can't keep the sword for myself. But I'd better go if we're to get the job done by this evening. Godspeed. See you later in the tavern. You certainly will. After today's work, the ale might even be on me. I won't lose my head, Jaden. No guillotine here. Well, not yet, I don't know. All right. And 
next thing is just the ale. All right, let's go and pick up the ale. Doesn't look like anybody really cares that I threw poop. I ain't gonna snitch. I ain't gonna snitch unless the guy forces me into it. I'll, I'll just do what I do to this guy every single day of his life. This guy here, okay, from this morning, from kicking me in the nuts and from treating us the way that he treated us. This guy needs some serious therapy after he finishes with us. Hey? Okay? You like that? You like that? Hey, they're actually getting levels up on that. that. They'll have to fix. I could beat the shit out of that guy for a long time. He just keeps on coming back for more. Cleaner freaking horses, man. Damn. I'm going to check. Do I need to eat? Probably a good thing to check if... Uh, yeah, nourishment, I'm low. Let's eat some stuff. Wait a second. Didn't he have food on his... He had food. Let's eat out of his pot. I mean, for freak's sake, he's got free food here. I probably should wash myself off with the manure and his water he drinks out of. Didn't he have food? I think we saw food. Was it here or was it his parents' place? I thought he was cooking something. Thought I saw something on food being cooked up. Ah, there it is. I was gonna eat your shit. Hey, are you dead? He's unconscious still. Oh, poor guy. Yeah, poor guy. <laughs> Had a rough day. <laughs> shit. Taught him a lesson or two. Arr. All right, it would be enough for that. Good day, Frenchie. Nice to see you, buddy. All right, let's go find the next place. There's a store. The tavern was here. What was the other one that we had to do here? Is this long round? Um, buy a nail, or we can go for a sword. I mean, I, I do like the sword idea. Hey, Pip, do you want to learn something? No, I don't think so. Thanks. Suit yourself. Why don't you teach me something? I want to learn some sword shit. My dad's already pissed off anyway. It's not going to help. <laughs> Have you recovered from yesterday's great wound? Oh, it was nothing. Except mother noticed and had a word or two to say about it. No mother's happy when a son starts to take an interest in swords. Where there's weapons, there's death. The question is, what do you want? I don't want to rot in this hole forever. I feel like I don't belong here. I want to live and see the world. The world's a dangerous place, and I need to know how to protect myself. Spoken like a man. And as it happens, today's your last chance. I have to leave. So, are you ready to get stuck in? Yes. All right. I wait on the ground by the sheepfold as usual. By the where? I mean, I'm not going to be going to my dad's place and shit, eh? Should I go and buy the stuff and bring it back to my dad's place? I go and fight him first. I mean, I, I'm sure my dad won't mind. I am defending myself with a sword. He does make them. Oh, just sheep's. Those sheep's are gonna get messed up here. All right, uh, do I have a sword on me? I don't think I have anything. I don't, I don't see myself with a sword. That's too bad. The tutorial is like a couple of hours long, G. Taking time. Really? That long? Well, I guess it's okay. If there's a lot of gameplay, then I don't mind being, uh, being intuitive. That, oh, look at it. That's a good reaction. Look at that. This one got stuck. Oh, I do like that a lot. Okay, where are you going, brother? Are we going to go inside this ring? I am right here. Did you... Let's do this. Let's rock this, baby. So, can we get started? No. Yes, of course. We can. Good. And since today's the last time we'll be seeing each other, you can show me everything I've taught you so far. Go oh, good. That's a good thing. Very well. Let's start with the basics. Keep moving. Your life depends on it. 
Hello, friend. Hello, friend. All right, all right. Now try to hit me. You have to put your weight into your attack. If you just fiddle around, you'll get nowhere. Try slashing from different sides. Unpredictability is the key. Never repeat yourself. Good. Wow, that's not easy. Oh, got him. He's good. The point of the blade is for stabbing. Try it a few times. Oh, how do you do that? Right bun. I can stab you. Good, good. No. Let's try something else. One strike, I can fend off without a sweat. But if you chain your strikes, I'll have a much harder time. As soon as you land one blow, follow it with another. All right. Hey. Whew. That's pretty helpful. At least we know the chain strikes. That's good. I don't know about you, but I'm tired and thirsty. Remember, though, train hard. No one becomes a master swordsman overnight. You have to work and work. And the main thing is to use what you've learned in real combat. There's nothing better than experience, believe me. All right. Thanks, mate. Safe travels. Thanks for showing me this. Love this game. Me too, Nigel. This game is stunning and beautiful and very well made. So far, I'm, uh, I'm beyond amazed. And fun, too. I like the start, how everything kind of starts off and talking to people and getting to know the game and the story gets you involved in it. May hello. the Lord watch over you, Henry. Hello, hello. Are you Bianca? She must be Bianca. It's gotta be Bianca. Bianca's nice looking. How long before you get brain damage well, from that? Save my lovely. <laughs> sure. You're looking well today. <laughs> you too, handsome. What brings you here? Your beauty, of course. <laughs> oh, noble sir. I'm as honored as any simple maid can be. And apart from my beauty, what else might your worship desire? Uh, yeah, it's I need ale for father. A pitcher as usual? Aye. Bring me a cool one from the cellar. <laughs> but of course. But of course. I die, I will be happy. That's a good thing. Make them all happy. Give me the ale. I'm going to have to barter with her too, or she's just going to give it to me. Here you, know. you are. Thanks. It's on me today. <laughs> you can pay me back this evening. Out of the question. Here you go. And this evening, I'll have something more for you. <laughs> I can't wait. <laughs> Thanks. You'll have something to look forward to this evening. <laughs> you too. Oh, um, by the way, that shifty-looking fellow was asking after you. Vanyan? I suppose. He is a man who makes his coin robbing honest wayfarers. I'm sure of it. I'll be happy when he's gone for good. But what in heaven's name are you up to with him? He promised to teach me how to use a sword. What use would that be to you? Enough. You sound just like father. I'll be going now. See you this evening. Hal, I've got something special for you. Is that so? Now what would that be? Your favorite, savior your schnapps. Really? You're an angel. <laughs> I hope you'll thank me properly later. You bet I will. Damn. Couldn't tell you more times we're gonna get it on tonight. <laughs> it's like, oh, is this here? A game in auto saves in time. Important uh, each quest. If you want to save the game yourselves, you must drink the potion. Save your snaps. However, this drink is an alcoholic drink, so you can't save every two seconds. That's a smart idea. 
Now, it does autosave too, but if you want to save it, that's pretty cool to have, right? Not to say. Let's break my head a bit. All right, Pa. Long story. You'll never believe what happened. <laughs> Shit. You're getting trouble. You're going to get in trouble for this, right? Savory snack. Uh, about. Oops, there yeah, about time. Have you got everything I wanted? Not yet. What are you talking about? I have charcoal, the hilt, and the ale. We can start. Good job. Let's have it then, son. Well done. You might have beat the shit out of your customers several times in a row. Right. Let's see what kind of job the master and Sasal did for us. Look at that lad. Well, that's what I call craftsmanship. What does the inscription mean? Damn if I know. Doesn't look like Czech to me. Latin, maybe? Lord Radzig ordered it. Oh, this will be the finest sword I've ever made. Have you got the charcoal? Good. And fire up the forge. We'll put it all together. Nice. That looks freaking nice, guys, I have to admit. By the way, someone paid me a call. I reckon you might know what it was about. I'm not sure. Really? Because I'm pretty sure you and your friends threw dung at Deutsch's freshly whitewashed house. He was here with the catchpole earlier, and it was not a friendly visit. What got into you, Hal? That Deutsch was talking treason in the tavern about Sigismund and the king. He got what he deserved. Got what he deserved, did he? You can go and clean up the mess you made and apologize to him. I have a trade to run. The German pays well. And having my son in the pillory helps nothing and nobody, least of all the king. You understand? Yes. Look me in the eye, Henry. Do you understand? I understand. Good. Then we'll never have this conversation again. So you think it's right to let traitors speak ill of our king? The boy gets caught making a fool of himself and he still hasn't learned his lesson. So Deutsch spouts rubbish and what? You turn into a common thug. You might win a fight with violence, but you'll never win an argument. Remember, Henry, if you want to convince someone that they're wrong, try using your mouth and not your fists. Oh, about that. I may have overbeamed uh, one of the guys up. The furnace is ready. Right, we'll do the grip. Wow, this is amazing. I'll heat it up, and when I take it out, you slip the grip on so it fits exactly. You know what you're doing. Wow. Do it. Good. Once more. Damn. No gloves. Uh, that's it. Done. Now file it down so it sits well in the hand. I'll prepare the guard. Very detailed this game. Wow. Father, why did you leave Prague? Who ever heard of a master swordsmith making horseshoes in a village? <laughs> I had my reasons, Hal. <laughs> and here I have your mother and you. Why would I want any other life? Do you remember Emperor Charles? I do. Life was good under his reign. Better than now. He built half of Prague and a score of castles. Had a bridge made over the Moldau and founded a university. And all without a war. He knew how to rule. Better than Wenceslas. Better by far. 
But Wenceslas doesn't have it easy. It's hard to step into the shoes of someone whose like is born only once a thousand years. What about Sigismund? Do you think Charles would have brought an army down on his own people like Sigismund? No. Wenceslas may not be the equal of his father, but Sigismund, he brings shame to the royal name. How's it going? Give it here, and we'll put it all together. My father sent me for those nails. Good day to you, Teresa. They're ready. Will you fetch them for me, Hal? They're in the trunk in the living room. Henry, are you all right? <laughs> oh, that was pretty intense. Oh, man. All right. Very cool. All right. Where is it? Uh, where do you tell it was, buddy? I think it's over here somewhere. <laughs> she seems to be laughing a lot. Uh, let's actually see the map here. I was so enthralled with that damn story. I'm like, holy crap. It's like watching a movie. Get three said nails. Where the frig is it? Let's take off that marker. Where are you, nails? I didn't hear what he said where it was. Do you guys, do you guys hear it? <laughs> See where it was. Got to be in here. My headset was breaking off. I'm going to have to buy a new one, that's for sure. Oh, there we go. Nails for Teresa. Take it. Holy crap, badges. Yeah, I'll take that too. Thank you. I even checked the chest. What oh god, gameage. This game is absolutely stunning. Stunning. Here you go, Teresa. By the way, I pay your debts really, really. Here are really those quick. nails you wanted. Thanks. So, how's Bianca? Um, she's fine. Uh oh. Why do you ask? Just wondering. Will you be going to the dance this evening? We will. Maybe we'll see each other there. Anyway, mustn't keep you. I'll be on my way. Uh oh. That sword is truly beautiful. I guess, uh,. I guess Teresa fancies him too. Oh, 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 he's looking the wrong way. Fine lass, eh? Now stop staring at her and come and see this. It's time for the trial by fire. <laughs> he's a dog. Hold on. We did a fine job. I would expect nothing less from such a renowned swordsmith. Well, those days are gone, sir. Hmm. You haven't lost your skills, though. Would you like to try it? Sir, what good is a sword to a commoner? Let try it. You still have a lot to learn. Ask your father to show you how. He knows what he's about. Learning his trade will serve him better in life, sir. Perhaps. But who knows what the future holds for each of us. I see that you almost have it finished. It just needs a polish, then Henry will bring it to you. Excellent. Fine work, very fine. A sword such as this will bring honor to its bearer. What say you say, Svan? True, Sir Radzik. If I'd have had its like back in Nicopolis, things would have worked out differently. How odd to find such an accomplished swordsmith working in a place like this. 
A man of his talent would have no problem making a fortune in Prague or Vienna. You're right. It's a very long and peculiar story. I'd be glad to listen to it over a cup of wine, but duty calls and I must leave. Here you are. Learn from your father. He truly is a master of his craft. I'm sure our paths will cross again. They certainly will. Once it's ready, send your son up to me with it. Good work, Martin. Sure. Yeah, we just told you that we're going to send your son. It's been an honor, Sir Ispa. Have a safe journey to Sasso. The honor is mine, Sir Radzik. Thank you for the hospitality. Mm -hmm. A long, peculiar history. That was a long time ago. I might tell you about it sometime, but not today. Will you teach me how to use it, like Sir Radzik said? Why? Well, it could come in useful. Maybe I'll travel a bit before settling down. I'd like to know more than the tavern on the green in the forge. You know the trouble with an adventurous life, son? It can end before it gets started. I might teach you how to handle a sword, and then someone will shoot you with a crossbow as soon as you set foot outside the house. You talk as if you've seen it happen. A man my age has seen a lot. Being a blacksmith might bring no glory, but it has its benefits, like keeping your head on your shoulders. I want to end my days in Scalitz, here, beneath the linden tree, and by your mother's side. Well, so do I, one day. But first, I'd like to see the world, meet new people. Meet them, or beat them. Meet. You have to keep going on about it. <laughs> then you've no need to learn swordplay. Uh oh. A messenger. He was in a hurry. What's happened? Under attack. Uh oh. Guess he's not going to beat Bianca tonight. Holy moly! Listen to me, Al. Listen carefully. Take the sword, go into the house, and grab anything else important from the trunk. Go to the castle. Hurry! What about you? That's a lot of men. Your mother is in the village. I'll fetch her and we'll follow right behind. I'll go with you. No. You'll do what I say right now. Give the sword to Sir Radzik. If anything happens, he'll take care of you. He owes me. Hello, friend. Hello, friend. All right, to go. This is really off the wall cool. Damn, bro. Oh, touching the woman? Ooh, don't do that. The fire killed everybody.
YouTube shot. Oh my god, really? Oh my god. Yikes. Rental went across this movie. <laughs> I don't know. The beginning is a long story. Find a horse. Ride to town, Merc. Tell them what's coming. Warn them. Run by the moat. There's a path down there. Jump down from the wall and flee. Seriously. <sighs> hey, come with us. No, let's close that door on you. Yeah, take the horse. Trunk of living room. Yeah, we got that one. Right, run. <laughs> Let's run. That means there's people behind me. That's great. Follow this little path. Where the hell am I going? Where am I going? Freak, freak, freak. Up there. Ah, shit. There's actually somebody behind me. I thought there would be no one. I was looking, going, ah, probably nobody there. Oh my god, this is bad idea. Alright, let's, let's let the stomach come back. Let's see if this asshole is still on me. Oh, he's still on me. Shit. Good job with the arrows. I don't know what she said. Out. I'm not inspecting. Do I have a sword? I do have a sword. How do you uh, take out your sword? I want to go back and save her, but I've got to figure out how to take out a sword. That'd be the number one thing. Ah, oh, shit. He's going to frick my horse. How do you switch the weapon out? I didn't check that part out. Did it? Did it? Oh shit! No, no, not the map. How do I fight? I don't think we can fight, can we? I think I made what it's called a, a... She got to close the door on him. Alright, I think I got something there. Don't just run. I can't. A woman's screaming for help. I just can't do that one. Uploading some of your live streams to YouTube. We do. It's, uh, it's uploaded right away. Right afterwards. Matthew, it's uploads right, right afterwards. I have a whole bunch of my live streams. I'm the only one who thought of taking a horse. Or it was told, I guess. Oh, crap. Nice. Well, better me than a horse. I ran all night. Well, he wanted to leave the town. He to was checking his own girl. Probably didn't work that well, did it? You're gonna die, G. Nope. <laughs> yeah, we finally made it, I think. Hey, Paul, how are you guys doing? This game is crazy cool. The wound must be banished. Which ow, ow. I, I don't know. Am I supposed to run? All right, I'm bleeding, but how am I supposed to stop the bleeding if I'm getting stabbed every two seconds? Excuse me, it's a part of the body. It's gonna affect it. Uh, yeah, yeah, I, I, 
The frig. Sorry, go through. Sorry about your uh, family. Sounds like a bunch of assholes to me. Yep, yep. Uh, oh, look, I, I found more yeah. horsemen. That's great. Oh, man, I'm just getting arrows up to yin yang. Oh, man, I'm dying. This is rough. How are you supposed to bandage yourself on a fo Oh, my God. I died in combat. I died being... What the freak was that about? Did I miss a button here? I need to gallop almost as pound on that button. I think that's what I have to do, right? Pound on the button, I bet you. I have to try it out. I've been pressing the button. I didn't realize I had to pound away. Oh, you got to be kidding. Controls. Where is it for the horse? Sorry, I got to make sure I get this right. It did pop up, but it's, by the time it happens, you're such in a hurry. Inventory, other... Show you a gallop or anything? Mount, call horses. Why? Target doesn't really give you all the. Uh... Oh, I'll have to read it as we're going. I think I have to tap that button. I have to tap that. The other guy's still behind me, right? I forgot about him. Hey, he's very. How you doing? The keyboard in me. Yeah, probably probably be a lot easier to keyboard. I switched up with the controller now, so I'm kind of like. All right, horse riding. There we go. Cool. Uh, trot is this. All right. That with B combines speed and stamina. And uh, okay, tap. That's it. Gallop faster by. It also drains the horse's stamina faster. Uh, B on your horse. And smarter than that, some other. Okay. All right. Well, let's let's give it a shot. Yeah, I don't know what you just said, but so be it. Oh yeah, look at that. Whoa, 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 whoa no. We want we want we want to jump over that. All right. I'm I'm now jammed into the fence. All right, all right, cool, cool, cool. Oh, I got knocked off. Shit, that's a thing. Oh, great. Is that my horse still? It isn't. Uh, oh, this one's actually nicer. Thanks. Oh, I like the saddle and color better. Thank you. You guys are slow with that sword, thankfully. <laughs> Can I ram these guys with this? Hope that completely messed his day up. Oh! Man, it's... A... Hey, Lost, take care, buddy. Thanks for being here. Ah, oh, man. Three times a charm. <laughs> Dread. Oh shit. Black horse. My horse changed colors. Alright, we already know this part. Let's skip the part. And we're gonna be running. We're, I'm, I'm gonna be ready for tapping. I'm gonna tap the living shit out of this button. Alright, let's let's go at this. Hasn't to quickly get to someone who can help you. Oh, I wish I could oh, I do I should do which one wants to jump. Damn it. Gallop like you never galloped before. Sorry. 
Oh shit. Oh my god. Oh my god, this is this is not good. At least I'm not getting stabbed with left. arrows. Halmo gets to the left along the stream. Oh, it really messed up the horse, does it? Okay. Pretty realistic. Let's tap the shit out of that one. Let's do a little bit of off-roading. Let's bring him to other people. He's like, I was fine until you brought some death to us. Yeah, I brought death. Oh, fuck. The guys really don't give up. Don't they have a life? No, seriously, run. I'd pick you up and be a nice guy, but I'm not. Somebody being maimed. Run for it. The fight keeps on saying run for it. Go, please. I'll kill you all. They're not stopping for you. I'm always hoping to stop and take care of the rest of these people. Gotta slow down a bit, let the horse, uh... He's getting tired. Wow, they're not, they're, they're relentless. Is there none of these people have a sword or anything they can shoot these guys with? Oh, wow. My fingers are like... <laughs> Galloping, there's... Tasty, you're too funny. Off-road seems to be slower. At least it felt like that. Oh I was going to hill, though. Thing stuck in my leg. <laughs> Someone give him a drink and bring hot wine and bandages. Wow, the, the faces are amazing. Yeah, the mask was beautiful, isn't it, Paul? Boy. Hey, zombie. Who are you, and where are you from? What in hell's name happened? I've come from Scalitz. They burned it to the ground. Slaughtered everyone. Who? Who burned it to the ground? A huge army. They attacked without warning. And, and they weren't Czechs or Germans either. Who then? I don't know. I've never seen armor like it or heard their language. Maybe Tartars? Tartars, you say? Yeah. Well, we'll deal with that later. First, let's have a look at that leg of yours. That was close as heck, Sully. How you doing? Grit your teeth, boy. I'm gonna pull that arrow out. Oh. oh, I felt the pain there. Oh, man, that, that can't be good. Easy. All done. You were lucky, lad. The arrow missed the bone. It only needed bandaging, and I've done that often enough before. War is a good teacher. Can you stand? There you go. Good as new. 
Oh, that's awesome. Thank you. If you idle, there's nothing better to do. Get back to work. You'll have to speak to Lord Divish. Can you manage? <laughs> yeah, links are friendly people. Imagine if you just walked right into nowhere. Thanks, Alexander. Unforced running. <laughs> uh, Sir, this is a survivor from. I heard Robart. Tell yeah. me, boy, what exactly happened? Did you see the insides of the attackers? And were there any more survivors? So, um, I don't know what army it was, but it was huge. There were dozens of banners flying on the hill above Scalitz. The ones who did the slaughtering spoke a, a, a strange language. They burned scallops to the ground. But a lot of people took refuge in the castle. I wasn't quick enough. And as I fled, they shouted from the battlements that I should come and warn you. The soldiers the boy didn't recognize. They could be those Cumans of Sigismund's. It said they came to Hungary from the east, and now they're the core of his army. Sacking Gutenberg must have given him a taste for stolen silver. Scallops is a small castle, sir. If Sigismund attacks, they can't hold. Indeed, Sir Robard. And our small garrison would be no help, even if we could risk sending them. You think we're next in line? Maybe. What's your name, boy? I'm Henry, son of the Scalitz blacksmith. I know him. Did he make it inside the castle? I'm sorry. It's in God's hands now. No one else can help us. Anyway, thank you for risking your neck to warn us. Robard, take care of Henry. Make sure he gets something to eat and some rest. Yes, sir. And get all the people inside the gates. We have to prepare for the worst. Make all the necessary arrangements. Wow, the As armor. you command, sir. Look at reflection in the armor. Stunning. Stunning job. Uh, worth every dime. If you ask me, this game is so far worth every single dime for this. It's a little pricey, but hey, uh, damn. Cinematic is stunning. The story is beautiful. I would ride somewhere now? Great. Sir Robard. All right, hopefully I'll learn how to use a sword. It would suck for that was not something. Porterhouse Gaming. Thank you so much. Finally caught a stream. Love the vids, Finally my friend. Finally caught a stream. Dot, dot, love the vids, my friend. Thank you so much. Big hashtags, Porterhouse Gaming. Thanks so much. Do appreciate that very much. That was very kind of you. Thank you, thank you. Yeah, this game is off the wall. Big hashtags, Porterhouse, guys, please. Supporting. All right. I'm uh, I'm not 100%. I'm last to check. And how about food-wise? I mean, boy, I feel like I uh, may need some food and shit. Uh, I don't want to steal anything from here. Oh, I'm dizzy. All right. Um, whoops. What, what's going on? Nourishment is extremely low. All right. Let's eat this up. We did have some. I think my nourishment is not going to help. Thankfully enough, we had a couple of things on us that we didn't lose even after being attacked. Health-wise, we're okay. Energy. Looks like we're tired as shit. Speech and charisma are red. I have a lot of apples, man. I'm going to have some acid reflux tonight. Lentil soup. Of course, I'm not. All right, nourishment is 60. Man, he could eat a lot. This boy, he is a growing boy. He is a growing boy. See, okay, that's a, that's a save. This port, this one was what? M info. Right, with immense, you cure light wounds and dispel hangover effects. Uh, okay. <laughs> Is he, uh, is he drunk? No, I think he's just in pain. What am I supposed to do now, brother? I mean, shouldn't you let me rest just a tiny bit? I mean, that's just saying. It would be good if we actually rested. Didn't have to clean the crap off the walls. <laughs> Dread. <laughs> Horse yet. I didn't have to apologize for shit. You've done well, lad. I'm sorry for your loss. You must be all done in. Why don't you go to the kitchen and have a good meal? Sorrow is easier to bear on a full stomach. 
Yeah, it's about 70 bucks Canadian. I heard about your father. I'm sorry about They say he was a swordsmith who it's moved to the countryside to make horseshoes. I can't understand why he'd waste his talents, but I'm sure he had his reasons. Don't tell me if he had a fine waste. reputation. Which closed door? Ah, milady. You are fortunate our good lady Stephanie of Talmberg has graced us with her presence. My lady, I'm honored. So this is our brave young man. Welcome, lad. Bojena here will take care of you. No doubt you're tired and hungry. <laughs> Indeed. How could he not be, poor soul? After everything he's been through, he must be as hungry as a bear, aren't you? Young master. These must be people from New Brunswick. Here you are, then. <laughs> They're too nice. Eat your fill. And a little wine to wash it down. Thank you, my lady. <clears throat> to use charisma on Stephanie. When you're done, you can go and rest with the grooms in the outer bailey. No, that won't do, Sir Robard. After all he's been through, he deserves a proper bed. Let him sleep in a lodge in the courtyard. Certainly, my lady. Young Henry here is overwhelmed by your generosity. Oh, yes, yes. Thank you, my lady. May God reward you for your kindness. Eat up now. You're in capable hands, so I'll leave you to it. Good night. Good night. Good night, good night man. Good night, good night. Royalty, eh? All right. When you've done, you can sleep in the bedchamber of the courtyard lodge. And don't forget to take off those filthy boots before getting into bed. Wow, we got upgraded by this fine young lady. I'm usually honest with everything, except for the deck who didn't want to give me my money. When he didn't give me my money, I wasn't too happy. I mean, he was a bit of a dick, too. He could have said, I don't have it. I said, okay. <laughs> yep, yep. Don't mind me. Yep, the queen told me I can uh, I can take whatever I feel like. And there will be no supper for any of you. I, I am I am a growing young man, as you said. Yes. I got it. Got it. Eat this up. Whoa, what the hell? You pee? Okay, was that? I was like, I thought someone was peeing in a corner. I was like, that's just gross in the kitchen. And you're just going to stand there and watch me. All right. All right. She's cute, too. Yeah, I'm no food for you guys. Sorry. Uh, did this my parents, too. It's all good. Some more cheese. What else do we have here? Oh, some bread. Oh, that's good. Some cheese and bread. Very nice of you guys. Bread. I guess a pita kind of maker. Is that it? Yeah. Anything else around here? Spoon. That sounds awful what you're doing there. Can you stop that, please? What is that? Fan. Oh, water. Oh, wine. Oh, shit. Yeah. If I get lucky with me, lady. Should I store? He hasn't even thought of his own girlfriend and stuff yet. Look where you're... Sorry, just gonna eat right out of the pot. Yeah, I'm a pig. All right, how does that help at all? Nourishment seventy seven. All right, let's let's see if that actually helps when I eat out of the pot while the she's. What is it? it? Nothing. I just want to eat. Look, I got a taste test of shit. I can't do it anymore. That's it. What are you doing? I'm 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 not doing anything bad. I'm sorry. All right, well that didn't help. I I guess you can only eat once out of that. Boy, people are very cheery here. I hear you came from Scarlet's today. It must have been terrible there. How did it happen? Well, it's a long story. I think we're going to tell it to her. If that messes. <laughs> P.S. I don't know. He could eat like a storm, but then again, he's a strappy young man. I remember being that age and eating that. Uh, I don't want to talk about it. It was awful. There we go. It seemed like any other day. And then I saw thick smoke rising above the hamlet of Rovna. Soon Sigismund's army were finished there and came for us. The order to attack must have come even before the alarm bell rang. God preserve us. Success. I fled the castle, but my parents were killed. Yeah. Yeah. We all ran towards the castle for shelter, but they were too fast for us. They slaughtered everyone they caught and torched their houses. 
I barely escaped and they... They killed... They murdered my parents. God bless you, boy. I'm terribly sorry for your loss. Do I deserve more food? Just saying. I'm just saying. Could use a little more food here. Drop... What was it? Drop into pot. Was, was that drop into pot? Oh. You can add shit to the pot? Are you kidding me? That's some pretty cool shit. You want to hear what happened to me today? No? All right. No one wants to hear anything else. My story is pretty lame. Is this water inside this? I forgot to check. Water? No, no water. All right. So be it. You want to hear my terrible story too? No. Doesn't seem like anybody really gives a shit. Oh, talk. Yeah, she does. All right, cool. I want to be able to tell my story to everybody. And then go to the courtyard and sleep and we'll run down there. <laughs> I thought, what's this? Uh, where can I sleep? Oh. Where's that chamber for me to sleep? Evans, are you still confused after what happened to you? It's in the lodge in the courtyard. Thank you. What a, what a mean woman. If I needed some food, who should I ask? Who do you think, young man? Me, of course. And if you want something extra, I could help you out with that too. Oh, she trades. I'd Great. like to buy something from you. Of course, lad. Is she blind? All right, we don't have very much, but we have uh, three sweet pancakes. Nourishment nine, that's what, milk is nourishment 13. How much do you want for that? Price 3.2? Yeah, we're going to hold that off right now. Rip off ours. Steal from your own king. All right, it's in a courtyard. Is that your bed there? Damn. It's for the horses, I guess. I don't know where the hell the bed's in the courtyard. You talking about this thing or what? <laughs> it's a bench. All right, there must be something in here. Nope. I hear you came from Skellis today. Yep, yep. It must have been terrible there. It was horrible. How did it happen? <sighs> well, go and ask a girl in the kitchen. She knows exactly what happened. There we go. Beautiful. All right, so you need tired, you need stamina, and equivalent to also gradually increase, which we need to sleep, so we can actually sit down on here. Uh, sit to launch sleep. All right, cool. Is there anything in this room I could take? Like, I don't want to steal, but since it's my room now, I hope they uh, don't look like they clean this shit up at all. All right, let's sit down on this. Let's start to sleep, and we'll get going. Red 5, how you doing? It's a prison for your hubby. All right, press A to sleep. Nice. Uh, 1900. I'm going to get as much sleep as I can. Well, early day, though. Good. Uh, I don't think he slept very much in the last few days. Let's say 6 a.m. 11 hours. Comfort's 80. That's nice. Nourishment is going down, of course. And we pause and we see what we got. Hopefully, it actually isn't so bad. I thought they'd go through a whole process. The patrols will be doubled. Keep your eyes peeled. If you see anything out of the ordinary, report it immediately. Understood? Yes, sir. Yes? Buck chicky wow wow. It is I, Henry. Forgive the intrusion. I didn't wake you, boy, did I? Uh, my lady, uh, um. No, no, not at all. But what brings you here at this hour? I thought you could do with a little wine. Oh, I see how it's going. It's just what you need to help you sleep. My lady, um, thank you. You really shouldn't. You could have sent a servant. I was going to, but to tell you the truth, I couldn't sleep either. I thought of you while saying my prayers. How awful it must have been for you. I came to offer you solace. To let you know you're not alone. 
Thank you. Thank you kindly. You're welcome. Now, Henry, I know this is all very new and strange for you. But I want you to feel at home here. You're not to worry about anything except getting better. God knows you've been through a terrible ordeal. I know what it is to be left alone in the world, although your loss is much greater. But with God's help, the pain will ease in time. And it can help to talk about it, if you feel like it. Yeah, she does like us. Yeah, it's some night aid, that's for sure. She is a kind soul. That's the way I think she is, too. I don't think she's trying to get it on. She has a, maybe a little bit of a... I, I just can't talk about it. Tell her story. You might be right, my lady. I'll tell you what happened. It was terrible and unexpected. The day started just like any other. Father sent me into town on some errands. I went to the tavern, Neil. His sweetheart and Bianca there. Yeah, let's stick with that. I went to the tavern to buy ale for father. I know it's a job for a groom, but I didn't mind, because my girl Bianca worked there. I courted her a while, and we agreed to meet in the evening, but our meeting was never to happen. Oh, dear boy. When I'd done all the errands, I headed back home. I promised father I'd help him with his work, and I was looking forward to it. He was forging a sword for Sir Radzig. Hmm. <laughs> Talk about life. Yeah, I'll stick with Father that. and I always chat in the forge. On that particular day, I asked him if he'd teach me swordsmanship. He said no. He said it's better for a man to keep his head on his shoulders than lose it over some pointless heroism. If only you'd known what fate had in store for us. Oh. This is working. But Sigismund's horde was already on the horizon, ready to attack the town. I saw smoke on the horizon. All right. I saw smoke on the horizon from a village Sigismund pillaged on the way to our town, which was soon to meet the same fate. God have mercy. She's fine, she's good. And then death descended on Scalitz. Scalitz took flight. Let's just try to fight the... Oh, there you go. The gate to the castle was open. The bells and horns sounded the alarm, and the villagers ran to the castle to take cover. They were carrying the few possessions they could grab in haste, and I saw the terror in their eyes. I can't even imagine how mm -hmm. awful it must have been. It was horrible. I ran to the castle like our neighbors to take cover, but I didn't make it. I had to find another way to save myself. The men on the battlements called down to me to flee to Talmberg and warn you. Hello, and I was lucky I knew a concealed path around the castle. Hmm. Uh, Currents of plundered village, the siege. I no longer heard any sounds of battle coming from the castle. So Sigismund's army must have regrouped and started preparing for siege. No doubt you're right. Then I heard a scream. It was Teresa, the mill wench. She'd been caught by a gang of cumin savages who planned to violate her. I had Sir Radzik's sword, and even though there were several of them and they were better armed, I had to try and save her. I wanted there to be at least one person I'd helped. And I succeeded, even though it almost cost me my life. Mm -hmm. After that, I stole a horse from them and rode off. Like a valiant knight. I'll never forget the horror. It will haunt me for the rest of my life. Well, it looks like... It's a... terrible. Oh, it's horrible. How could something like that happen? I don't know. God well, alone knows why conference. he let such things happen. Oh, you poor boy. <sighs> I understand your grief, but God is not to blame for the ills of this world. That is the work of Satan and those who do his bidding. Those who are corrupted by greed, envy, and pride. You must not lose faith, whatever life brings. <laughs> Fate has not been merciful to me and my husband either. Husband. Although, in comparison to the horrors you went through... I was young when I married my husband. Hmm. It was my father's wish. Divish was a lot older than I, but 
A woman must bear her lot. Shortly after our marriage, before I even got a look at Talmberg, the castle was stormed and my husband was imprisoned. Really? My husband had some quarrel with Sir Havel Medek of Valdek, who decided to resolve it by force. He stormed the castle, burned down the village of Pribislavitz, and killed many of our men, even the old Chamberlain. He imprisoned my husband in the castle and put his own garrison there. Hmm. That's awful. She needs comforting, too. I was barely 18 years old, and all of a sudden, I was left alone with Sir Robert. We didn't know what to do. We went to Prague to appeal to the king and sought help from Divish's friends, but all to no avail. We tried for years, but it seemed I was destined to be left alone and my husband to rot in jail in his own castle. Years, you say? Seven years. Oh boy. That's how long it took before Havel was condemned as an enemy of the crown. And even then, he refused to surrender the castle and release my husband. In the end, I raised the money to pay a ransom. And only then, by the grace of Lord Jesus, did I finally lay eyes on my husband once more. Seven years. And was Havel punished for it? Never. And after seven years, my husband returned to me an infirm old man. Infirm. Sir Divish seems like a good, strong man. Well, certainly. Only he has many concerns. He had to rebuild Talmberg. After he was released, the king appointed him Burgrave of Prague Castle, and he was very busy. He had no time for me at all. But at least we were in the city, and there was something going on. And now, we're here. My lady, you're still young and beautiful. Your pills your for your husband. best years are still ahead of you. Would that that were true, lad. Would it were true. But what am I doing bothering you with this? You have troubles enough of your own. I'll go and let you sleep. I enjoyed our little talk, Henry. Good night, and God bless. Good night, my lady. Oh, Henry, can have a hard time sleeping now. He lost his girlfriend today, doesn't give a shit. Man's resilience. <laughs> his sword turns. <laughs> it's very. <laughs> oh my God. Oh, that is intense. Oh, boy. of the county. Henry, wake up. You don't want to miss this. What is it? What's happening? Come to the battlements. One of our patrols reported a company heading here from Skelets. Can't you get a good night's sleep here? I mean, does it make a difference? Go to the battlement via uh, via the gate time. Let's do this. Take a torch from the table. Where, where, where? Oh, there she is. Cool. And. Ah, cool. Cool, cool, cool. Uh, why don't you wake these guys up? Women and men in the same place? I'll be damned. All 
Alright, well, I'm out and about here. Anybody else around here? We can go up here. How'd you get up there? I don't think I should walk inside the building with a torch. I think it's here. Kind of lost anyways. The frig are they? Tree Leaf, thank you so much for the support. I really do appreciate it. Big hashtag Tree Leaf, and I think I, I completely foobarred this. Now. Say my name. I'm reading chat at the same time, but I didn't really get to see what you're saying. Goddamn say. right. Let's get up here. You! What the hell are you fooling around here for? Be off right now or I'll fucking see you off. Okay. Well, this is not it. What hmm. part didn't you understand? Uh, did, did you see me try and go down a ladder? Asshole. Do Committed a crime. The frig? I'm just looking for the goddamn guy. If I have to choose a place, then right here behind me. That frees a bellman. Surrender! Sorry, coming through. Hopefully next scene will stop you guys from touching me. Oh god. Everybody's pissed. Oh good. Listen up. If it's Sigismund and his army, prepare for the worst. Don't move a muscle. But don't be daunted by their numbers. Surrender. Heed my commands and all You've will be. Committed a well. crime, and I'm arresting you. Seriously? I'm you telling you, hey, surrender. Down there. <laughs> Tell the people outside the do? walls to prepare for attack. Quickly, do you understand? Are you going to give yourself up, or do you want to do this the hard way? Right. What the frig? Holy crap. Surrender, surrender. Holy crap. Wow. I went up a friggin' ladder. <laughs> I hate to see if you steal their damn horses. Oh my god, that's pretty... Thankfully, we can fast forward through some of that stuff. That was insane. I was not expecting that. I was just looking around for the place. I mean, I figured I'd just go up there and then you know, walk through. But I guess that's the wrong place. I think you just screwed yourself. No, it's not so bad. I don't want to go through a whole scene again. We can fast forward, thankfully. All right, let's get a torch off the table. At least the save is up pretty good. We won't go back up there, I promise. Turn it on. Thank you. All right. Yeah, snitch and that's not a bet you do that shit. All right, up here. Boom, boom. They don't know this country like we do. Oh, you're okay with me being up here, though? Ah, uh, you might be right. For sure, Sigismund ain't no fool. Yeah, everybody's okay with that. If it's Sigismund and his army, prepare for the worst. Getting the butt beat. But don't be daunted by their numbers. Heed my commands, and all will end well. All right. Hey, you men down there. Tell the people outside the walls to prepare for attack. Quickly, do you understand? I was you I should talk to. Maybe that would have stopped them from hurting me. Thanks for sitting there and watching that, by the way, asshole. Uh, what's going on? What's going on? I don't know. It doesn't make sense. Why would Sigismund advance on Talmurg in the night? Especially since he's lost the element of surprise after the raid on Scalots. Maybe it's not him. Then who is it? The scouts Jivish sent to Scalots to spy on Sigismund, said he'd set up camp and was getting ready to storm the castle. And Sir Radzig is an experienced soldier. He'd surely hold the castle for quite some time. It doesn't make sense. What else did the spies see? Not much of anything. Before they could get close enough, this huge storm started. And you were right. Sigismund has a hell of a lot of soldiers, including all manner of mercenaries. An army like that costs a fortune. Well, anyway, we'll find out when they get here, won't we? Aye, we will. 
Two for two and one tax. Gotta love it. Oh, here we go. This is bad shit going on. Bad chi. Oh! Who goes there? Lucifer and all his minions. Who else, Robert? Sir Ansig. What a relief. Is his lordship there with you? Yes, sir. He is right here. Okay. What are you doing up so late, Divish? At your age, you need a good night's sleep. <laughs> well, Rantic, you didn't exactly pick the best time for an outing either. In a big hurry? It was a bit of a scramble, all right. Believe it or not, this Tempest is a godsend for me and my men. As my old granddad used to say, better a sore throat than a slit throat. I'd say your grandfather was a wise man. Your messenger told us what happened. Messenger? The lad you sent to warn us. He's alive? He made it to you? He's here with me. He only got away by the skin of his teeth, though. Thank God. A brave young man. But tell me, friend, how on earth did you manage to get away? Thank God for this tempest. When it began, Sigismund's Tatars crawled into their holes and left a storm in the castle for more clement weather. We were able to sneak out right under their noses. The Lord be praised. We wouldn't have stood a chance against them. Would you like to spend the night in Tumber? No, no. When Sigismund finds the castle empty tomorrow, he might come looking for us. We'd only be exposing you to danger. Without me and my men, he has no call to attack you. Well, what will you do then? We'll march to Ratai. It's only a short way, and there we'll have a better chance of defense and enough room for all of these people. If Sigismund should come, better bend your knee, Divish. There's no point dying in a battle that's futile. You're right there. Is that boy still with you? I'm here, sir. You have courage, lad. That I can't deny. <clears throat> I am sorry about what happened. Would you care to join us? I'd like to, sir, but first I have to return to Scalitz. <clears throat> Are you mad? What do you want there? I can't leave my mother and father. I won't leave their corpses rotting in the street. I'll join you once I've taken care of them. Don't even think of going back there, you donkey. Are you tired of living? But sir! Quiet! Chef Ramsey. I'm sorry about your father, but getting killed as well won't help him. Divish, make sure that lad doesn't budge from Talmberg until things quieten down. Not to worry, friend. Anyway, he's injured and needs to recover. I'll lock him up here as if he were Havel of Baldic. <laughs> I've seen you've grown a thick skin since your tribulation, sir. But thank you. We'll meet again when circumstances are more favorable. Farewell. Farewell, friend, and good fortune. Give my regards to Sir Hanish. I will, and good luck to you and your people, too. It's a dark times. Move out! Anywhere, people, move out! Make your bills walk. Damn. Wow, that is, yeah, we're about two hours in, yeah, we're about two hours in. Got a little bit more time left. I just want to see a little more of this. Of course, you guys like this, make sure you hit the like button and support and it. I'll play a little more we'll tomorrow. Patrols. Sort out the watches between you as always. So nice, the armor. And if I catch anyone boozing, playing dice or slacking off, I'll personally break every bone in his body. I want you to keep a close eye on everything nearby. What you looking at? Sigismund will surely have sent spies. And likely men as well to follow the Scalitz people now he knows they've fled. Keep your eyes peeled and report everything to me at once. Understood? Why does that guy keep on staring my crotch? Why does he st stop staring my crotch? Thank you. Jeez. Henry, I need to have a word with you. Damn. Yes, sir. Need to steal armor to escape, really. What is it you need? I could use an extra pair of eyes, and yours are keen. Will you keep watch on the battlements with my men? Is that a request or an order? I'd rather it was a request you answered yes to. Of course I'll help. I'll have to pay you back somehow after all you've done for me. Splendid. And don't worry. I'll tell the men to relieve you later. That and you're inside the freaking castle and you almost banged his hey. wife. Let's go. Let's just stand here. Oh, oh, 
Got sword. So what are we supposed to do now? We're supposed to just... Uh-huh. It's dark there, too. I should take this off. Oh, that's, that's a little bit easier to see. God, it was so hard to see through this. Oh, there's something there. Am I supposed to go somewhere now? Oh, someone's here. What the hell's going on? Why are they attacking Wandering me? around like a stray sheep. Must be your first watch, eh? Keep up the good work, sir. I don't work, think sir. anything much will be happening today. You can just lean against the wall and wait till morning. I'll show you what's what. I will. Thank you. Wow, what a bunch of douchebags. Thank you so much to uh, Pods... Sorry, Podster. Thank you so much for the very kind donation. I really do appreciate it. That is very cool. Okay, a big hashtag of Podster. Thank you so much for supporting the stream and keeping going. All right, uh, to wait. Something you can skip. All right, go press that. I don't know. Uh, 5 a.m.? Do I at least sleep? We're going to lose energy for this. I'm losing energy waiting. That's great. Da, da, da. Nourishment, too. Hopefully, they have free food for me since I did some work. That is very nice. The wait, that was beautiful. Everybody else okay? We're all good? Nothing going on? Oh, he's coming back. Um, I did my job. <laughs> I did my job, I swear to God. Casey Fiber Bits. Thank you so much, sweetheart. So sweet. Hit the like button. Yes, please, if you can. Um, what am I supposed to do now? Just, uh, just continue walking this out. I, I don't see anything. There's still nothing here, and there is nothing. <laughs> this is too funny. Uh oh. I'm hearing something. Uh, is there anything showing up on my menu? Nothing at all. Do I have to wait an extra hour or something? How you doing, guards? My respects to you. Hmm. What do you think about these guards managing and slip away like that? All right. What do you think about how the Scarlet's folk managed to get away? Fortune smiled on him, that's for certain. Sigismund must be seething with rage. It's just a shame Fortune didn't smile on all of them. Oh, shit. Sorry. And you know Sir Radzi Kobler? I wouldn't say I know him. I've seen him a few times. Why do you ask? He must be a fine lord to take such good care of every one of his serfs. Mm -hmm. Surely all the lords do that. Ah. I could tell you some stories. About Sir Divish? Jesus, no. I didn't mean it like that. Just that I heard stories from other soldiers that would make your skin crawl. Oh, shit. See. What do you think about how the Scarlet's folk managed to oh, get away? Oh, shit, not again. Fortune smiled. It's just a shame. Let's fast oh, forward shit. this. And you know, Sorry. I wouldn't say I... <laughs> he must be a... Surely all the... Oop, look. let's ah. fast forward. About to do this. Yep. Jesus, oh. no. Let's see. Listen quick. All right, end dialogue. Now. You guys would want to do that twice. Same That's for sure. Name. Eggy, thanks so much for the $2 donation. Thanks so much, buddy. You're goddamn right. You're awesome. Got here a bit late. Like the game? Love the game, Eggy. Love the game. Oh, shit. Hello, friend. Jesus. Hey, watch it. Aren't you guys supposed to move? Because I need to figure out where the hell you're going. I'm going. How come everybody has armor and not me? This sons of bitches. Let's go, let's go. Couldn't afford an extra piece? You want to talk about my life? Go, go. Am I going to the right place? Yes. There we go. Yeah, that's not good. Holy moly. self-appointed king wins the love and respect of his loyal subjects. Indeed, Robard. 
Sigismund of Luxembourg has a rare talent for winning people over to his cause. We may be in for a surprise. I don't think he will set his heathen dogs on us today. Greetings, Lord of Tomberg. That's the bastard who let the attacker scholars and kill my parents. Don't be an idiot. Do you want to end up like them? I am Sir Mark Vart von Aulitz. I come in the name of Sigismund of Luxembourg, King of Hungary and Croatia, who has resolved to strike against those who disrupt Concord in the land and to restore order in the name of his brother, King Wenceslaus IV. And his lost soldiers. Restore order by burning and pillaging the king's estates. Greetings, Sir Markvard. The efforts of the king's brother to bring order to this chaotic land are undoubtedly noble. It seems to me, though, that he and his army have somewhat strayed. As Burgrave of Prague Castle, I am entirely beholden to the king, and here in Taunberg, divine peace reigned until your arrival. To what then do we owe the honor of your visit? Yesterday, His Majesty took action against the enemy of the kingdom, Sir Ratzik Kobila, who has been using the silver from the Scalitz mine to fund insurrection against the crown. Unfortunately, the insurgent escaped. Would you happen to know, noble sir, where he might be at this time? As far as I know, the Sir Radzik, of which you speak, is the king's hetman at Skalitz. I find it hard to imagine that he would rebel against our king. Nevertheless, I can assure you that Sir Radzik is not at Talberg. He would be a fool indeed to flee from one castle, where he has little chance of defense, to another, where he has even less. Or do you take the view that my humble manner is any obstacle to your army? Am I to inform the king then that the Razzi Kobila is not a Tamburg and that he has your loyalty? Sir Radzi Kobila is not here, and I have no intention of getting embroiled in affairs from which I have nothing to gain. Very well, sir. As you wish. I will relay your words to the king in the hope he will be as well disposed as you seem to be. Those who have clean consciences and good will may find themselves well disposed even at moments like this, when there is little cause for joy. Farewell, sir. Auf Wiedersehen. Auf Wiedersehen, now, goodbye. Adieu, adieu. Say my All right, now I got some music in my head. You're goddamn right. Tree Leaf, thank you so much for the $10 donation. Thank you so much for the stream, guys. Big hashtag, Tree Leaf. Very cool of you. Thank you so much. Very cool name, too, Tree Leaf. I meant to say that a while back. Nice mustache. Uh oh. Okay. Phew. Turn around. My lord, you have my utmost admiration. Get on with you, Robard. Oh my god. He is a good negotiator, man. Because I would have told him to f off and run for my life. <laughs> Tomato I am sphere. <laughs> Get one of those deers. He hasn't called everybody off yet, has he? I don't think he's that happy yet. I don't think he's that happy, guys. Right. Are you serious? I, I'm not even moving, you asshole. Damn it! Oh, excuse me. Come through. All right. Well, that was that was some stressful shit right there. All right. Am I supposed to talk to somebody? Like, I mean, good job, brother, for not getting me killed and uh, literally kissing some serious ass. But you know. That, that, that look like troops were way too much. Fight another day. Fight another day. Do you guys have a special week? Oh, there's... there's. Yeah. Didn't say it was bright. Just said I was going to follow you. <laughs> Some food here. 
Some cabbage. All right, what are we supposed to do now? I'm looking around. Somebody's walking I need to talk to. Okay, so hide in sight. Is I, I knew exactly which one I had to talk to. There we go. Hey there, buddy. Combat arena. Awesome. I, I definitely need the skills after the last time we saw that. The hills are alive with the sound of mute armies. <laughs> yes, exactly. A phoenix say goodbye. That's it. My respects to you. A lot, yes, Rich. You're probably better off uh, seeing from the beginning. You lose out. The, the story is so beautiful. Uh, I have to get to skills. Like, okay, this is a stupid thing to say right now. Your parents are dead, unfortunately. What happened in Gutenberg? Gutenberg. Well, I'm just a simple soldier, but the good Lord gave me ears. And I've heard some things from Sir Divish and from those who fled from Sigismund's pillaging. Were there many? Indeed. But it was the Kutenberg mercenaries who came to see me, because I knew them from before. I see. Listen, lad. These are all games of the high aristocracy. In Prague, a cabal of nobles rebelled against King Wenceslas, wealthy aristocrats who took against our king for reasons of their own. There's no doubt Sigismund had his fingers in the whole affair. Him and Wenceslas's cousin, Jobst. And that cabal helped him abduct the king. So then why did Sigismund attack Kuttenberg? Why do you think? Wow. I mean, uh, just me or the story is impeccable, guys. Yeah. <laughs> we'll see the facial hair for the win. Uh, to feed his troops. I'd be careful, right? I actually won't have any effect. No, let's just do this. Because it's a fertile place with full granaries that could feed Sigismund's troops? <laughs> That's not it. I don't know. King Charles, may God grant him eternal glory, built Prague into a proper royal city. I tried to while play. King Wenceslas took a liking to Kutenberg. After Prague, it's My the Chris. most important city in Bohemia, in the entire Holy Roman Empire. He who commands the Kutenberg silver is king. So Kutenberg sided with Wenceslas because he favored it. Now you're starting to understand. When Sigismund imprisoned Wenceslas and took control of Prague, the people of Kutenberg began to raise an army against him. So with the attack on Kutenberg, Sigismund killed two birds with one stone. He defeated Wenceslas's most powerful allies before they could stand against him and also gained immense wealth. Damn, the story is just so freaking damn amazing. But can the story change? I don't know, actually. I'll have to ask and see. I think it may affect when you start talking to certain people and lose their confidence. Um, yeah, I think there might be some stuff like that. What about uh, Cumans? Sure. Where did these Cumans come from, anyway? I don't know much about them. Only what the Chamberlain said. That they came to Hungary from the east and settled there. They're godless barbarians and merciless fighters. The nobles used to say the Hungarian king shouldn't enlist them because they dishonor our rules of warfare. But when there's power and money to be had, it seems that honor isn't worth my spit. And believe me, it's always about power and money. So, Robard, I need to get to Scalitz. What would you do there, lad? Sigismund might have left, but the place will be swamped with robber barons, brigands, Deserters and other vermin. And anyway, your lord commanded you to stay here. Alright. I have to bury my parents. My parents died there, and I won't leave them to be ravaged by dogs. I have to bury them. Good God, boy. Do you want to throw your life away for those who can never get theirs back? Do you think that's what they'd want? Forget it. That didn't work out. Alright. Why did Sigismund burn down Scalitz and then come here, too? That's war for you, lad. Certain lords have resolved to take things into their own hands and eliminate too, anyone Sully. who doesn't share their view. Unfortunately, Sir Radzig is one of those. And what's more, he was sitting on a pile of silver that could help King Wenceslas' allies. Perfect. All right, end the dialogue, buddy. Wow, like the dialogue. Beautiful game. Nice and early morning. I don't know if the time flies... In the daytime, it doesn't go down really quick. Depends on what we're going to do. I guess sleep is going to be something. Anyways, we're fatigued. Look at countryside. Look at us. It's so perfectly well made. 
This game is stunning. I always pick it up, guys, if you want to. The link's in the description field, too. If you guys like this, make sure you hit like button and get in the comment fields and tell me, you know what, I want to see more of this. I would actually stream it tomorrow night if you guys want to. Uh, I would actually get involved maybe in the stream it tomorrow afternoon or night. I don't know. Maybe tomorrow afternoon. I don't know. Sounds actually a lot of fun. I want to do a little more of this. I'm really interested in the story, but it's going on for almost two and a half hours, so it is what it is. And we do have a, our mods here too, have a lives of their own, and I don't want to hold them back either. They're in from England. So thank you guys for here. Thank you all the final people who actually who have joined, and of course, who are now part of the community, and also the kind donations. And our moderators too, as you can see now. That's pretty cool. So very cool. Actually, now thanks also to the moderators, which I really appreciate too. That's a new thing added. Subscriptions too. Thanks so much, guys. And for all you kind of people who have been part of this game, you guys are absolutely awesome. And well, part of the stream, it's been a lot of fun. <laughs> more! Get in the fields, guys. Tell me if you want to see more. I need to hear it. I need to see the like buttons if you guys can. I will definitely finish up this uh, as fast as we possibly can and go through. I mean, this is a, an amazing story. I'm, 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 I'm awe. I'm awestruck. It's absolutely beautiful. The sounds, the looks, isn't it stunning? Oh my god. I might flip over to the mouse, though. I think the joystick's hurting my hands. <laughs> you guys are absolutely awesome. Big kudos to all of you. Thank you, all of my wonderful moderators. Thank you for being here. You guys are absolutely awesome. This is the Edge Image. I'll catch you guys on the flip side.